Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Today we will have a new lesson for grade nine. Uh, it's titled Hygiene. Uh, it's uh, lesson six in our uh, student book. Uh, we have an article. It's titled Clean Water, Fresh Hope. Uh, but we, before we start our lesson, I want to everyone uh, to introduce himself. Uh, please start. I am Muhammad Abed. I am Mustafa Al Kabri. I am Abdul Rahman Al Rahman. My name is Ahmad Al My name is Hamza Sheikh Al Basad. Okay. Uh, to, the, to, to, uh, to start the lesson, I want to Muhammad uh, present uh, the slides and uh, uh, to manage the. Yes, teacher. Well, we will start with the vocabulary. Who can do the Uh, basic, basic, more important or necessary than any, anything else. Very good. Healthy. Yes, Mustafa? Good for your body. Absolutely. Essential. Good. Yes, Hamza? Extremely important and necessary. Yes. Basic. Charity. Charity. Well, a deep hole in the ground from which you can't take water or oil. Help. Muhammad, you must touch a little. Yes. Yes, Abdelhamid. Bump, a machine for moving liquid or gas. Haji. Yes, Abdelhamid. The rules for keeping your, uh, you and your uh, surroundings clean. Very well. Community. The people who live in the same area, town, etc. Okay. Supply. Yes, Hamza. An amount of something that is available to be used. Okay. Rainfall. Yes, Hamza. The quantity of rain that falls. Cool. Bucket. Yes, Hamza. A container with a handle for holding water. A tank. Yes, Hamza. Uh, regularly. Uh, to school, uh, to a school and meeting in. Okay. Enthusiastic. Yes, Hamza. Uh, feeling or showing a lot of interest and ex excitement about something. Excitement. Some excitement, excitement about something. Okay. Suffer. Yes, Suffer. To experience uh, physical or mental pain. Disease. Okay, Zabra. An el uh, an el illnesses. Uh, which affects uh, a person, animal, or plant? An illness. An illness. Cholera. Okay. A, a serious di uh, disi disease that uh, causes uh, sick sickness and some uh, sometimes death. Okay. That's all. Yes, Mustafa. To make something uh, completely different. Well, we'll start with the lesson. Clean water is essential for healthy living, but millions of people around the world don't have water for their basic needs. Water aid is a, a charity that helps people in Africa get safe, clean water, dig wells, install pumps, and learn about hygiene. Very good. At the next part, yes, Before Peter Hudson visited a village in Sudan. He had only seen life in the big African cities. In village, the biggest problem is water. There, he met Ibrahim and his family. They showed him how water for Africa and the water project in Sudan had changed their lives. Excellent. And this one, yes, Hamza? The charities had helped the community to dig a well, and now they had a supply for dr of drinking water. Ibrahim said the rainfall is very low here. So having a well is important, important too. Okay. And this part? Yes, other part? He's 14 years old. 
daughter is called Nahla. She was carrying two buckets of water. She had got it from the well, because the well is only 300 meters from her home. She now has time to collect the water with her brother and sister and attend school. And this part, yes, Mr. He talked to Ibrahim, the nine-year-old son, Ziyad, outside the village school. After he had finished a lesson on hygiene, he was very enthusiastic. He said, it's uh, very important to use uh, soap uh, and uh, wash your hands. He also met Ibrahim's wife. Hiba, sh uh, she was uh, em emptying uh, a bucket of water on the vegetable uh, in the garden. She had just uh, cleaned uh, the house. Very good. At the fire part, yes, uh, Hazel? Ibrahim explained that before the well, the villagers had suffered from various diseases, including cholera. Now they had clean water for cooking washing and the cleaning. Their lives, uh, lives were completely, uh, completely transformed. Very well. And do we move to, the, to this exercise? Choose the right answer, A, B, or C, to complete the following. Who can do this work? Yes, the people around the world don't have water for their basic needs. Many, uh, or few, or not many, many. OK, that's true. Yes, Water aid is a that helps people in Africa. Hospital, charity, bank. The answer were through charity. That's right. And this one? Yes, Mustafa? Ibrahim said uh, that uh, having a will was uh, uh, useless, uh, essential, not important. Uh, the answer question uh, is essential. That's right. And this one? Yes, Hamdan? Nahla is Ibrahim's mother, daughter, wife. The correct answer, daughter. That's right. And this one? Yes, Ziad was very, after he had finished a lesson uh, on hygiene, eager, sad, worried, eager. 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 That's right. And this one? Yes, Hamza? The well has made the visual, uh, villagers poorer, healthier, suffer from diseases, healthier. I will move to this exercise. Find words in the text that mean the following. Words. Yes, Mustafa? A container uh, with uh, a handle for holding water, a uh, bucket. That's right. And this exercise? Yes, Mustafa? A deep hole in the ground from which you can take water or oil. Uh, well. Very good. That's right. And this one? Uh, the quantity of rain that falls, uh, rain falls. A machine for moving liquid or gas. Pump. The rules for keeping uh, you and your surrounding clean hygiene. And we move to this one. Read the article again and decide if these sentences are true or false. Uh, poor people pay uh, water aid, so they uh, water aid they uh, so they can get clean water. Uh, false. Water aid only helps people in Africa get fresh vegetables. Vegetables. False. Life in uh, African cities and villages is difficult. True. The new well isn't far from Ibrahim's house. True. That's right. And this one? Yes, Hamza? Before the well, the villagers had suffered from cholera. True. Excellent. And this? Yes, Mustafa? Nahla doesn't have uh, time to go to school. False. Excellent. Yes, Hamza. Yes. And this one? Yes, Ahmad? Hiba would like to have clean water for her basic needs. Uh, true. The well has made the villagers healthier. True. Cool. Ask the following questions. Why is water important? Yes, Ahmed? Oh, yes, Hamza? Clean water is essential for uh, uh, for healthy living. 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 That's right. Where did Ibrahim and his family come from? Yes, Ahmed? 
They are from Sudan. What was Hiba doing in the garden? She was emptying a bucket of water on the uh, vegetable uh, in the garden. What was the lesson in the village school about? Yes, Mustafa? It was a lesson uh, in Hajj. That's right. Grammar in context past perfect. Read the sentences and decide which action in the text happened first. Well, we have an example. A. Peter Hudson saw Sudan. B. Peter Hudson saw big African cities. B. Had happened before A. Who to be the first? The first uh, event, uh, Nahla got uh, water from the well. The second event, uh, better met Nahla. Okay. Yes, Ziad learned about hygiene. Uh, the first. Uh, the first sentence. The first sentence. Uh, the second sentence better meet Ziad. We will see. Yeah, That's right. Right. Then I decided to with the past perfect. Peter Hudson saw Sudan. Peter Hudson saw big African cities. Uh, Peter Hudson has seen big African cities before he saw Sudan. Yes, Hudson? Peter met uh, Nahla after Nahla got, uh, had got water from the well. That's right. Yes, uh, Ziad learned, uh, Z Ziad uh, uh, had learned about hygiene before. Peter met Zia. Very well. Give explanations. Invent explanations for this situation. Well, we have an example. People were leaving the football stadium. The football match has ended. This one? Yes, that one? Imam bought a new watch. Uh, she had lost her uh, old watch. You see? Very well. Yes, Hamzeh? Hussein was very tired. He had played football for three hours. Very good. Yes, there was fire uh, in the kitchen. My sister uh, had uh, forgot uh, the oil on the oven. Excellent. Yes, that's right. Yes, The school was empty. It had been a holiday. Very well. Thank you. Thank you very much. Thank you, everyone, for listening to all. Listen. This is the end.